Tandarus Ordo, the Mandalorian hero. Um, there are three major Mandalorian heroes in the Mandalorian faction that I would be considering um, adding to your collection or including in your Mandalorian army. Um, and he is definitely one of them. 48 points. Um, and as you can see, that is the miniature. Um, absolutely love the miniature. It's got a very unique blaster as well, which I'll talk about a little bit later. So he starts off with 120 hit points, which is pretty tanky, but a very, very low defense of 17. Um, as you can see, he probably doesn't wear a lot of armor. Um, I guess that's probably why and reflected in his very low defense of 17, which makes him really, really vulnerable. However, he's got a special ability that does counteract his low defense. He's got a high um, attack of 10 and then does damage 30 because he's got a heavy weapon. Um, but what is unique about Ordo is the fact that he has a heavy weapon um, but he can move and still use the heavy weapon. There are a few characters uh, that have a move restriction with heavy weapons. You cannot move and shoot in the same turn. Um, but with this particular blaster, it does heavy damage of 30, but you are still allowed to move at the same time as shooting. Um, he is a unique character. And he's only got two special abilities. One, um, he is able to do triple attack. So you could either do a single attack of 10 with um, Candorus, or you could do you could not move and do three attacks in one turn. So he gets two extra attacks if you do not move, which. I mean, it means you could do up to 90 damage in one turn. And if you do a critical, if you roll a natural 20, um, that is 60 damage on the spot there. He also has a very unique regeneration 10. So if this character doesn't move on his turn, remove 10 damage from him at the end of the turn. So basically, you could not move at all with this character um, and at the end of the turn remove a damage counter of 10 off of him which is very very useful indeed so he has that low defense but with combined with regeneration 10 and uh, high hit points yeah I mean if you don't move for two or three turns you are taking off damage off this character which is very very uh, useful. Um, you could still also be in uh, combat and adjacent to other miniatures and even if you are attacking them um, the character doesn't count as moving so you can still carry on attacking other characters it's just as long as you don't move you can still use that regeneration 10 and um, you know potentially get your hit points back up to full after maybe you've taken lots of damage overall a very very good character with some weaknesses but with some real strengths as well and combined with the other two um mandalore the ultimate and um mandalore the indomitable as well he, those three are really tanky but i've taken ordo by himself with a load of mandalorians and um it makes for a very very strong mandalorian squad the mandalorian squad is very very strong anyway especially when it comes to shooting so um adding him for 48 points i would yeah i would definitely consider it because he's so so strong um and that is candorous ordo